In this section, we are going to see how to change MLFB number over relay backup file. The purpose of changing this MLFB number is if we have a same relay logic for many relay but their MLFE is different if you don't want to configure all relay you can change the MLFE number according to that relay and you can upload the settings file to the relay so that your time of consuming will be less or if you have a previous project the same logic you are going to use in other project but the MLFE number of the two relay is different so you can use that file over here by changing the MLFE number let's go into the topic let's let's see how to change MLFB number just right click in your relay template and you can go for properties which will be on the last of the menu over here the second column MLFE you can able to see here you can change from the 7th to 16th number according to your relay MLFE number if you change this in your previous project when you see when you go for it saving this MLFE number it will affect your IEC file if you don't want to affect this just export the DEXE file from the backup of the relay and make one dummy project over there you can import this DXE file and over there you can change the MLFE number according to the, your relay and you can send it to the relay directly If you think it's useful for your friend, you can share this video to them. Thank you for watching this video.